from the day, the event before, all right? Yeah, here I am, my partner. She was like, okay, Manuel, we gotta do this, okay? You promise you're not gonna drink, all right? Yeah, she's gonna be like, yo, I don't talk like that. Yes, she do. <laughs> right? Yeah, she do. Right? Yeah, so, and I was like, no, okay, just one sip, just one sip. Yeah, one sip, one sip, yeah. So, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna kill it, because I was, uh, there was some haters at the event, you know what I'm talking about, and I had to kick their ass, you know? But, unfortunately, I didn't control my liquor, okay? And I woke up the next morning. And as soon as I woke up, right, I asked my partner, uh, what happened with the show? Do we dance? Oh. And my partner, looked at me and turned around. <laughs> oh boy, that's mm. when I found out something was going on. Then I go to talk to my students. Everybody was like, <laughs> like, I was like, what was that? And then I sat down and I was having flashbacks at the event. Flashbacks. Oh, I was there. Oh, I talked to so-and-so. Oh, I was getting ready for the show. Oh, I actually performed. How was that show? Hmm, I don't know. And then, oh, I actually, well, we even party. Oh, listen. That right there was the worst. That was rock bottom, bro. The worst mm -hmm. as an artist. I was laughing because I was so embarrassed, all right, that I that I don't believe that I did that to myself. I looked at the show, yeah, ugh, was terrible. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, it for, was. For my level, was okay. terrible because I basically mm -hmm. freaked out throughout the show. My partner was very upset, you know, uh, and people actually have kind of, my friends, they have told me, they actually spoke with me and they actually told me like, bro, you know, I mean, um, yeah, that's not the way. I, I remember my brother Dave, Dave, yeah, Dave from, uh, he was like, bro, I brought someone and she basically, she told me, I don't think that's professional. I really don't. That cut me really deep because I could not control. And my ego made me drink even more so that that way I kind of was so embarrassed and I forgot, you know, I'm talking about who I am because I'm a performer. I can, I can destroy the stage. But at that moment, the alcohol clouded me so much that not even a show I could do because simply the promoters liked me when I was drunk. Ooh. I would be the, the classic clown. You know mm. what I'm talking about? They love me when I was drunk. You know what I'm talking about? Because drunk, I could do just funny stuff, you know? And, but then you have to be professional. So it's a double edge knife. So you gotta be the clown, but what? they don't want you to be professional because that looks also bad for the event. Well, that was my worst experience on drinking i could not remember i woke up the next morning not knowing what the heck was going and it took me five fully minutes to actually start remembering mm. that i uh was there i did that i talked to someone else so it it is it is a destroying, it is a destroying career movement when you deal with dancing. It will actually destroy your career. It will actually, uh, you might think that things are good and things are bad. It's like, you know, when you think you, yeah, yeah you performing and the girl is looking at you, be like, bro, I'm, I'm, you're hurting me. <laughs> you, know, you know what I'm 